All right, y'all, we're in New Mexico. Got Ace out here, wife out here. We're running a 5K, Alien 5K tomorrow. Got the Texas fitted on, you know what's going on. These are our bibs. We got the Alien shirts, you know what I'm saying? We got our our first, second, and third place uh, medals. TJC, <laughs> look at the college, TJC. Ace, we got our first Alien. <laughs> Hey, see the alien sitting over there by the got building? an alien over here. Got some mountains coming up. Might be where we're Is this where we're headed or we're headed past this? I don't know. Trying to find an outline shot. Looking for these mountain lions, man. I know they're out here. I got it. Oh, you see that little cave right there? I know there's a, a, a lion in there. You see it? You see it? Stop shit. I'm trying to watch that quiet. There we go. Get that quiet out here little apes looking for these mountain lions this is how we hike out here socks and flip-flops all right y'all we're headed down three to five minutes three to five minutes three to five minutes and point underground it's a caves underground hey say what's up youtube okay that wife is here happy wife happy wife this whole process man takes about an hour hour and a half and uh it's crazy man happy wife happy life we're in the middle of nowhere man it's stuff you gotta do man to please your wife it's crazy going down and under that's where the cave is that we're headed all right chat we're headed to this cave man headed to this cave so are these bats or birds oh okay Oh, yeah. Yeah, I see. Alright, are you serious? Well, luckily I can't smell it. So we're headed to that. We are hundreds of feet from where we first came in. Crazy, man. Crazy. There's estimated to be over three to four hundred thousand bats that are in here, too. It's been real dark now. I was not able to pick up the light in this. No, got a little trail, but it's pitch dark down here. Man. Some lighting though. Oh, 
Whew. Winded. Shame. It's nice and cold down here. Got a mile left. Underground before we're finished. Let's see your bat. Your mom's acting like she doesn't know where she parked. We survived, man. Happy wife, happy it's life. We're in the desert, mom. We're in the desert, I said. Desert has. All right, mom. We got this 5K Alien Chase UFO Festival. Ace, what place are you getting? Mm -hmm. You're gonna finish, right? Yeah. Ace's got his. He's got his Roman T-shirt on. Well, my Wifey's got her wife. grown woman t-shirt on. He's got his alien uh, shades on. Uh, wow. The 1947 Boswell UFO incident. Okay. Do you think they're real? destructive power was comparable to about 22 kilotons of TNT. This event sent a message to the entire galaxy. You are not alone. Narrow objective. Investigate nuclear damage. World travel engaged. Three, two, one.
Okay, so we are at the car parade out here in New Mexico. What were your thoughts on the car parade? I've seen much better in rural East Texas, but if this is what they consider a parade, a car parade, car show, then so be it. I was unimpressed. My bad, y'all. Yes, this is the car show at first, and then we're going to go into the car parade here in a second. Yeah, the car show. Very, lots of retros. very old school retros. Wasn't as many cars as we're, you know, we're expected to see them, but you know, we're out here in Texas. We're used to seeing candy paint, rims, that sort of thing. Not necessarily the older, older cars. I mean, the older cars aren't bad, but this is like super, super old. So, you know, it's nothing worth truly seeing. Uh, I will, you know, give respect to these dudes because I'm sure some of these cars, since they're so retro, or a lot of money. What did you think about like the little gimmicks and accessories? I thought I, I was confused because this is a UFO festival, but they clearly went with like a Halloween theme. Just didn't match the, the vibe. Well, I guess that's how they get down in New Mexico. Go with the pool. Ten seconds. Twenty seconds. Uh oh. Uh oh. Stay with it. Stay with it. Thirty five seconds. Uh oh. Uh oh. Stay with it, Ace. Stay with it. <laughs> Stay with it. Oh. Uh-oh. Huh? Uh-oh. Sliding. You're sliding. Slide forward. Uh-oh. 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 Uh -oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> okay, so what'd you have for dinner? octopus and mexican rice what'd that, you think about it it was great it was amazing how they get such good octopus in landlocked roswell new mexico i don't know but that was the highlight of the trip honestly uh, i had some sushi i didn't get all the sushi in but overall Spice. thoughts on the trip overall thoughts on the trip one to five one being terrible five being amazing roswell new mexico gets a one star in my book that once you get past the UFO gimmicks, which only takes 30 minutes, there's nothing else this town has to offer. Uh, here goes the parade, y'all. Overall thoughts on the parade? Again, I don't know what they consider parades in Roswell, but that was a sorry excuse. Look, that's the only actual parade. I mean, float that we saw in the whole parade. The rest of it's just trucks. The, the men in black, we got a challenger. That was it. Yeah, it, it was a terrible parade. They weren't even throwing anything. To me, the highlight of a parade is throwing stuff at the kids, like candy, whatever, or adults. We pretty much feel like we saw the entire city in like 30 minutes. And that's the reason why we're giving it a one star out of five.